Good day, fine people. A very warm welcome to you. My name is Nick, and it's time for a boxing game on the Sega Genesis or Mega Drive, depending on where you are in the world. And as you can read, it says James Buster Douglas Knockout Boxing. It was known on other systems as Final Blow uh, in Japan as well, uh, but the arcade cabinet was also uh, called Final Blow uh, from Taito in 1988. We're going to put it on normal mode. I'm not going to put it on hard mode. I'm not a sucker here. I have reviewed Final Blow on the Commodore Amiga, and it was very, very easy if you got the uh, character in the corner. This was published by Sega in 1990. There's Buster Douglas there. Uh, perhaps they got the Buster Douglas license because uh, there was a shock defeat where he beat Mike Tyson. He was 42 to 1 to win that game, so he's a bit of an underdog. Uh, so they, it was a 10th round knockout. So uh, there. So there's the uh, the fight. It's not a great deal. It's Buster Douglas, Dynamite Joe, King Jason, Fernando Gomez, and Kim Nang. Here I go. It's the controls: a left punch, right punch, block, and various combinations depending on where you are with the D-pad. I'm that guy on the left, Buster Douglas. It always looks like he's been hit a few times. Anyway, so it's me versus King Jason. Check the energy bars down the bottom there. I'm the white one. The computer is the blue one. I've got him in the corner. Left and right punches. There's the referee going backward and forward, trying to do some crazy side moonwalking. I don't know what he's doing with his hands. I don't know. What's going on there? Uh, well, uh, yes. I, I, if you're a girl, don't dance near him in a club. Right. Time is ticking down in the middle. If you had this game back in the day, let me know. It's a bit harder than the Amiga version. Um, yes, this isn't expert gameplay, it's dodgy gameplay, ninkapoop chat, and seeing how you would have got on the first or second go. Now, if it's a draw at the end of three rounds, whoever's got the highest points, you can see CPU's got five, well, yes, he's got less than me, uh, that they are declared the winner, and you must defeat all four boxers in the order that they come at you. I'm in the white trunks, he's in the blue trunks, so let me know down below what coloured trunks you've got on. Not speedo, oh, good, good hitting. Get down, King Jason. He's not the king of the ring now. The crowd are moving. Or oh, they're doing rude signs at me. I'm not sure. What, what's up with them? Oh, they're very aggressive. Anyway, never mind. Very red colour palette there. Uh, so I've won. Buster Douglas on my first go. I've knocked down King Jason. So there's a bit of tactics to it. Uh, left punch, right punch with the buttons. Uh, the other button is block and up and down to do various uppercuts and long range punching. So, you, there is tactics involved, or you can button mash a bit like I'm doing. This guy is Fernando Gomez. Here he is. He looks quite old. He looks like Vincent Price or a Terry Thomas or someone, if you know them. I'll try and use the same tactics again. Right, oh, bit of holding there. Oh, yeah, he, this guy's a little bit better. Energy bars do go back up again slightly sometimes. Three rounds, you can have five rounds or one round. Oh god, hard or easy. Oh, I'm taking a bit of a batter in here. Don't get against the ropes. Come on, break. So I haven't reviewed a great deal of boxing games on the Mega Drive. Can't remember any. Oh dear, I've been floored by Fernando Gomez. So as you can see, the other boxers are fictional in this. Buster Douglas is not fictional. If you are Buster Douglas and you are fictional, then comment in the comment section below. Yes, yes, it would have been final blow. God, I wish I could go back in time and put a, a thousand pounds on the Buster Douglas to beat Mike Tyson at 42 to 1. That's just crazy town. Right, he's throwing a lot of punches here, not doing much blocking. I'm fighting like I would do in a Rocky uh, movie. Uh, this game would have worked better, I think, if they were all Rocky characters. Clubber Lang, Apollo Creed, and he played a bit of music beforehand, and Hulk Hogan, he was in it as Thunderlips. Right, come on. Come on, I must get Gomez. I'm doing a bit better here. I've been knocked down, but I've got up again. If you get knocked down three times in the same round, that counts as a technical knockout, and you lose. Come on, go down, Fernando Gomez. I got much... Uh, almost... Oh, he just... Oh, I thought I always had him then. Oh, God. If only the round had been a bit longer. So he's going to get a bit more energy now, I think. There we go. Round two. Here we go. Oh, his energy's gone back up again. So that's a bit of a pain there. The crowd are going, going as crazy as before. and not as excited. Red. Oh, I'm getting drawn back to the ring. Yeah, we've both got white boots on. Lovely white boots. Kinky boots. Kinky boots. Kinky boots. Yeah, oh, God. I don't want to get against the ropes, but then it's Doomsville. It's very 2D, this. Go backward and forward. The referee will count stuff. My favourite boxing game, I think. It's not really pure boxing. It's Panzer Kickboxing. Although it did come out on the Mega Drive or something else, so I do like it on the Commodore Amiga. Throwing a lot of weak punches. We've got white gloves on. Why not red gloves? Have a, have a look at that. See if red gloves turn up a bit later on. 
So on normal mode, as I say, I'm a newbie, so on normal mode here, you have got a bit of a chance with this. Hard mode, you have to use the tactics as best as you can, knowing when to lunge in with your punches and when to block. You can tell I'm pretty much doing button mashing. If you have completed the game, let me know what happens when you've defeated all the other four boxes. CPU, come on, biff him, biff him. Uh, baby, uh, right. no training in this, uh, it, it's pure boxing, you're just doing the fighting and nothing else, so no management there of any description at all, I think this is going to go the distance this one, unless I try and, uh, yeah, I'm trying to do long range punches, that was a good one, Fernando Gomez, he's jumped out the way there, right, okay, this might go to a split decision this, bong bong, Oh, so you don't, you can't do, I think you can maybe set it to 12 rounds, but anyway, I'm doing three rounds. Seconds away, round three. In the white corner with the white trunks is Buster Douglas fighting Fernando Gomez. I could be a great boxing um, announcer, that'd be great. Come on, this is going to go to a split decision, so who's got the highest energy bar, I think, unless I can get some sort of success in the last minute of this round. Uh, there's lots of heavyweight boxers, isn't there? Because there's lots of different well, world champions, because there's lots of different belts. There was re reunification fights and stuff, but uh, I don't think there any be anyone ever as, as aggressive as Mike Tyson. Just trying to fit the other boxing games in the Mega Drive. You might have already put them in the comment section below. There's some, I think there's a Muhammad Ali one, maybe a George Foreman one. Not to get mixed up with George Formby, of course. Turned out nice again. He was always going out cleaning windows. That wouldn't have been a very good computer game. Window cleaner professional or something. Red, come on. Am I winning? I think I'm slightly losing the energy bars, but or maybe I'm slightly ahead. 28 seconds. Wait. We don't want to do holding. Yes, come on. Oh, God. I think he's got a slight lead now. I'm losing it right near the end. It's going right to the distance. The three rounds. Biff it. You can see what I mean, though, can't you? It seems like there's a slightly red veneer on these graphics. Unless it's out wrong with my computer screen, but you'll find out. Right, four seconds. I think he's going to win this on a, on a split decision. Right, we'll find out. How's the referee going to judge this? Here we go. See, the point's going down. Energy going down. He wins. 10-5, the, the, the judges have scored it. Curses, blast, blast, curses, blast, blast, curses, and curses again. Uh, please consider subscribing if you watch this far into the video. Uh, there, and big thank you to those people subscribed so far. So we'll do one continue, see if I can get a bit of a chance. I'll be a bit more cavalier this time, see if I can go full in. Massive thanks to the members as well. I know main, the main stuff that's watched on the channel is Mega Drive, but I do look at a few other systems as well, just to get a comparison. No, the main stuff that's looked at is Spectrum, but I do look at other systems as well, just to get a comparison of what comes just after it. And it's good that you look at other systems as well, because it gives you a more um, fuller picture of the retro gaming scene. You, you might be someone that just watches the Mega Drive stuff, I don't know, but I try and peel to the systems I cover. Right, this uh, more cavalier approach isn't working very well. Look at his blue bar compared to my white bar. And I get knocked down early here. I think we'll take out one of the other uh, boxes for a spin and probably put it on easy mode. Perhaps do one round so it's a little bit quicker and go around again. The aim of views to be about uh, 10 minutes in length. Sometimes they go over here. Oh, God, I've hit the floor. I've hit the floor, baby. I'm back up again. Right, so, come on, let's hope for a miracle. Maybe I'll get a lucky punch. That was a good uppercut by me. Oh, yes. Oh, he jumped out of the way. Come on. Oh, I'm down again. This is no time for sunbathing, Buster. Get up, Buster. Seven. He's going to get up. Eight. Nine. Oh, it's just up on the ninth count. Uh, no, I see. I think, yeah, it's a technical knockout. As I told you before, knocked down three times. That Fernando Gomez is pretty good. Fernando Gomez knockout boxing, it should have been. Right, game over. So you get one continue and then that's it. So it gives you a little bit of a chance to fight the four boxes. Right, so you can do two players as well, which would be great fun. Spectator mode, that's pretty much demo. Uh, right, so it's one round. Let's get it on easy peasy. On easy, that'll do. So hopefully the bar goes on a bit quicker. We won't be Buster Douglas this time. There's King Jason, Fernando Gomez. What about Kim Nang? Let's uh, Dynamite Joe. I think I want to be Kim Nang. There's that ace there and the weight. There we go. Kim Nang. So what colour shorts has he got on? He's got red shorts, but they got white gloves again. Come on, Kim Nang. 
Right, here we go. He's fighting King Jason. Looks a little bit different than before. Is that to my imagination? Running away with me. Right. Now, on the final blow version, I'll see it didn't have Buster Douglas. It had a, a character called the Detroit Kid. That's in Japan. So, you know. And I uh, floored him quite easily. Maybe it's too easy. There we go. King Jason. They're gone. So I think we'll have to fight Buster Douglas in this. That was fairly straightforward. Good. First round knockout. Go on, go Kim Nang. There he is. Graphics quite similar apart from the head. I think the head just changed on Panzer Kickboxing as well, that one I mentioned before. If you're actually in the middle of a World Heavyweights Fighting Championship watching the video, then comment in the comment section below. Right, okay. Let's get a bit of payback here for Fernando Gomez, who's knocked us down twice. He's showing off. He's confident. He's already won two fights in this video. Come on. You're going down, Fernando Gomez. Or is he? Oh, he's a tough customer. Did the referee have a red a bow tie on before? Has he bought that before? I think he's. I think he's been. You know. I think he's been conned. I think he's been bribed. I mean, there was a game on the Spectrum. I think it might come up in the Amiga as well. By fair means or foul, where you can do punches below the belt. Oh look, he's going to beat me again, despite being uneasy. That's no good. Oh, I hate you, Fernando Gomez. If you're watching, Fernando Gomez. Oh. It's, it's a bit close, this. I need a lucky punch. Oh, got me with the old one too. It's like a Gary Glass jaw. Oh, Gomez. Duh. Oh, man. This could go either way. Send me your positive thoughts, people. Maybe I need to be wearing a crash helmet. Is that allowed? We've got a good, good, good combination there. Come on, just a lucky punch. Yes. Surely just a couple more. Only 30 seconds left. It's going to end either way here. It's only one round. My one back away. Yeah, good punch. Right on the nose. You're going down, Gomez. Stay down. Stay down, you fool. Don't get up. Nine. He's down. Yay. And the winner is Kunang. Gomez, your career's over. There he is again. I wonder if we're going to be all four boxers here. Yay! Take that, big nose. Match three, Dynamite Joe. Well, we're not hanging around here. The crowd are the same. They've all got the same seating positions. Winner stays on, it seems, which is which is weird for a boxing match. White gloves again. Everyone's wearing white gloves. Dynamite Joe. He's named Joe, and he's dynamite. He's got blonde hair. Come on, Kim Nang. Kim Nang. Has there ever been an Asian? Has there ever been an Asian world heavyweight champion of the world? Let me know. Let me know in the comment section below. Oh, God. I'm going to, yeah, this isn't going my way. I think Dynamite Joe's got me. Could be the end of Kim Nang. Get up, Kim Nang. So, you know, even on easy mode... As you get to these more advanced boxers, you have to use your skills, and I didn't get up there. Maybe I should have hit some buttons or something, but he's gone to sleepy bye-bye time, and he's going to wake up about four years later in the future, I think. Maybe. There we go. Game over. Game over, dude. Okay, dokey. Thank you very much. Well, I hope you liked looking at that game. That was James Buster Douglas Knockout Boxing, otherwise known as Final uh, Blow in Japan, based on the arcade cabinet from Taito in 1988. If you want to comment about this game, similar games, or anything retro, then by all means put that in the comment section below. You're always more than welcome. And until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye. There's the referee going backward and forward, trying to do some crazy side moonwalking. I don't know what he's doing with his hands. I don't know. What's going on there? Uh, well, uh, yes. I, I, if you're a girl, don't dance near him in a club.